Hello friends, welcome back to my channel for another project life video. Today I have week 15 and I am going to be using the L Studio April kit. I just got it in the mail last week and I was super excited to play with it and I did get some of the add-ons which I have over here in the little heart bowl off to my left hand side. Um, Everything in there except for that little coffee cup and the wood veneer are from L Studio. So, um, yeah, there's some lots of great pieces in their add-ons um, this month. Some cork hearts, some die cuts, some little word phrase stickers. Um, and, yeah, so I got quite a bit of add-ons this month. Last month, I don't think I got any. I think I got um, a puffy alpha and that was it this month I got um, quite a few things. <laughs> so right now I'm just going through the cards and I'm trying to figure out what exactly I want where. Um, the only thing I'm going to be honest with you guys, the only thing I don't care about L Studio kits are um, there's not enough four by six cards. Uh, you only get usually two or three cards in each kit and that's not enough for even one page um, for me. So I end up having to go in my stash and I actually pulled out an L Studio um, card from I think their January or February kit. I can't remember which kit this was from, but thankfully most of their um, kits kind of coordinate color-wise, so it doesn't look like it's it doesn't look like it doesn't fit. So um, I'm okay with that. <laughs> um, so this week I really didn't have that many photos compared to normally like normally I have one card without photos and that's it um this one I actually have three cards with no photos um and so yeah I, I guess I didn't have that many photos happening this week um so the card that I'm working on right now is a picture of my tv in the living room um I guess I could have just like screenshot maybe like the show on Google or something, but I just took a picture of my TV. <laughs> I started watching New Girl on Netflix and I never watched it when it was like on TV. Um, so I'm watching that currently. I actually started watching it about a month ago, I think. Um, but this photo was taken about a month ago, but I decided since I didn't have that many cards or that many pictures, I decided to go ahead and throw this one in there because I am still currently watching New Girl and I am kind of, um, like binging it. Like I've been watching it and there's so many seasons. I think I'm not even going to say cause I don't remember, but there's a lot of seasons and I think that I'm on season three, I think. Um, so yeah. Um, I'm using some alphas from not Lawn Fawn. What is that company? Um, something Fawn. Is it, let's see, Freckled Fawn. I knew it had a Fawn in it. <laughs> I've had those for quite a while. They're purple and I really like them. They come with two sheets. Um, I really like them, but I don't use them that often. But for this layout, I thought it worked because there's purple in this um, kit. So that card I kept pr pretty simple. I used a little frame and a cork heart that says right now and then a little banner from the die cuts that says loving this and I used my tiny attacher to staple the heart um, on the little card. And now I have a picture of me with Starbucks. Um, I had stopped that weekend and got myself some Starbucks after I went grocery shopping and just took a quick pic, um, a quick selfie. And so I'm using a little die cut from the die cut pack that says happiness captured. And then this little cork heart that says the best. Um, now I'm moving on to a photo of Greg and Maggie. Greg put his glasses on Maggie and she hated it but she stood still just long enough for me to get a picture. So you guys might not be able to see it because she kind of blends in with the couch because she's brown like the couch. Um, well, she's black, but she's got brown on her. Um, but yeah, she is 
she's got the glasses on and she looks super cute. So the die cut that I decided to use for that says love this and it has like a little heart kind of layered behind it. And then a little banner that says my favorite kind of day. And then I'm just going to layer another heart over top of that. Um, and I'm also using a lot of these tiny glue dots in this um, spread because a lot of these little tiny hearts are very, very small and I can't use my ATG on them because it will probably rip them. And then I don't really personally like using liquid glue over top of my photos. So yeah, that's why I've been using those. Um, so now I have this coffee mug and it has been sitting on my desk for probably over a year. Um, and I just haven't used it. And so it doesn't really particularly match with this kind of kit or this page. Um, but it has some of the similar colors in it. So I decided to go for it um, and kind of just make this card pretty. And I'm just going to write my current Starbucks order, like the order that I've been getting for the past couple of months, which is a venti white mocha caramel drizzle with sweet cream cold foam. Blah. That's a lot to say. Um, and I actually end up spelling caramel wrong um, because I had a brain fart and I couldn't remember how to spell it. And so I asked my daughter how to spell it and she spelled it wrong as well. <laughs> so I'm going to actually leave it wrong in the page because it's a funny story because I spell things wrong quite often and I don't care. <laughs> so I'm leaving it. Um, so I ended up using the little acetate hearts um, that I got for the add-ons this month um, with the color. So I used the red on the red, the orange on the orange, purple on purple, pink on pink, um, and so on and so forth. And so I really like the way that that looks. And then on this little blue card, I ended up doing the two tiny blue hearts on the um, small white hearts. And I like the way that, that looks. I love these acetate hearts. They're really cute. Um, when I saw them on L Studios uh, website, when I was doing my order, I was like, mm, I don't know. I'm, I have a really hard time using acetate pieces. Um, but these were quite easy to use and they're already sticky. And you really don't see the adhesive behind them, which kind of really makes me happy. Um, because that's one of the reasons why I don't like to use acetate is because you can see the sticky behind it. So for this card, um, usually I make a four by six card, my title card. Um, but for this week, I'm actually making a three by four card, my title card. Um, and I'm just putting week 15. And then on one of the little labels, I put the date with my roller date stamp. And I'm actually going to end up bringing in some enamel dots for my stash. And these enamel dots are from Bella Boulevard, I believe. And they're matte. Um, I love them. They're my favorite. I need more. I, this is the only pack that I have left. And I really need to get some more. I really like those. Um, so for this card, I trimmed down these two photos of Emily and Maggie. Um, I don't, I can't remember if Maggie had just been playing outside really hard or what. Um, but Emily came and picked her up. We were all at, hanging out outside. Greg was grilling and Emily picked her up and she just started to fall asleep in Emily's arms. Like she never does that. She doesn't do that for anybody. Like she doesn't fall asleep in anybody's arms. She'll lay down on your lap and maybe like cuddle you for a little bit, but then she's going to go and lay on like lay down somewhere she doesn't <laughs> sleep on anybody so I took some little photos of that and then like Emily's reaction her face she was like what is happening so yeah I did that and I put one of the frames over top one of the photos I really like the way that looks I think that's super cute and the little banner that I added for that one says love these photos and then the cork heart that I ended up using says I love you and as you guys just saw, I made this little tiny bow with some pink and white twine. Um, I had a little like scrap piece of twine sitting on my desk. And so I thought that that would work for um, a little bow. And so it did. And look how cute it is. It's so tiny. <laughs> um, okay, so now we're moving on to the photo of me on the lawnmower mowing the grass. 
Um, you can't see the lawnmower because it's just a selfie. I have my earbuds in. I'm wearing a hat. Um, but yeah, that was me mowing the grass for the second time that week. And I'm going to use some die cuts and I'm going to layer those up um, to put a die cut on top. So what am I doing? Yeah, I'm layering the purple and the yellow. And then I'm going to put the word selfie over top of that. Um, it's kind of just like a little place for it to sit. And then I'm going to use one of those tiny little die cut hearts. And I really like those. I love anything L Studio hearts. Like I love any of their kinds of hearts. I love the shape of them. I think that they're like the perfect heart. <laughs> um, and so I'm going to work on my title for this card. Now, y'all, this title, um, I don't know, it kind of went in a different direction. Um, but I didn't know what to do. And then I was looking at it and I was like, oh, yeah. So I ended up going with he thinks my tractor is sexy. Now, if you don't know, it's, that's a, that's an old country song. It's called, she thinks my tractor's sexy. Um, but I took it in my way because my husband is a male and I put, he thinks my tractor's sexy. Now I didn't have an S in the alphabet that I used for tractor. Um, so I said is sexy instead of he thinks my tractor's sexy. Anyways, I ended up using several different fonts for this, and I really, really love the way that turns out, and I thought it was super cute and kind of funny. So yeah, that is pretty much my spread for the week. I am going to do a little bit of journaling on the last card for each of the photos. There were five little individual spots here, and there were five photos, so I thought that was perfect. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you enjoy scrapbooking and project life videos. Don't forget, I'm going to have 30 days of videos for the month of May. So if you have not seen my calendar on Facebook or in my community tab here on YouTube, check that out. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to spread love and be kind. I hope that you all have an amazing day. Bye friends. Thank you.